Have you ever wondered what it's like to lie on a bed of nails? Is it comfortable? Is it even possible to do it without getting injured? Well, I'm going to answer all those questions and more in this video. Please remember that these nails are real and very sharp. You may be asking, if the average weight of a human is 137 pounds, how can just a few nails support all of that weight? Well thanks to the distribution of weight and surface area, we are able to lie on a bed of nails. Let's say for instance you weigh 150 pounds. If you were to stand on just one nail, you would be putting 150 pounds worth of force on the tip of that nail. That would easily go through your foot. Now let's say you were standing on a 1 foot by 1 foot square of nails that had 75 nails in it. If you were standing on each nail, you'd be putting about 2 pounds of force on each nail tip. Even though that's significantly less, it would still hurt you and possibly even go through your foot as well. Now let's say you're laying on a 6 foot by 3 foot bed of nails that had more nails per square foot in it, totaling about 1000 nails. If you were laying on all of them, you'd be putting 0.15 pounds of force on the tip of each nail. Due to this, you would actually be able to lay on it relatively unharmed. Due to the larger surface area and the increase in the amount of nails, your weight would be distributed across more nails and you would be fine. What's really good about this is that if you have enough nails in surface area, then you'll be able to actually add more than your weight on the bed. As you can see, my dad puts a wooden board and a cinder block on top of me, and he even picks up the block and then drops it on me, yet I am still fine. Even though we're adding the extra weight, it's still just a fraction of what it would be if it was only on one nail, so I am still able to lay on it comfortably. What's really great about this is that I could actually have someone stand on top of me because the distribution of weight is so well. However, McWayne Science Center only wants one person on the bed of nails at once, so unfortunately, we weren't able to record that. This is a small scale experiment of what's happening when you lie on a bed of nails with a block of wood, nails, and a balloon. What you see here is that we're actually pushing down on the balloon, putting more force on it. Even though there's nails under the balloon and we're putting more force onto the balloon, it won't pop. That's because there's so many nails under it that the distribution of the weight and force is so little. Because as the balloon is pushed down, it expands and its surface area gets bigger. So there's even less weight on each nail, even though you're putting more force onto it that bed over there and they're up and you decide to push yourself up on your elbows, you're going to have little holes in your elbow because it's going to poke you. Right? Now, because those nails aren't blunted, those are real nails. This is what's going on in the small scale version except this time we're back at the bed of nails. Even though we push down on the balloon, nothing will happen. Well, that is unless you get one nail on the corner and the balloon pops. Even though the nails are sharp and people actually weigh a lot compared to the nails, you're able to lay on it safely because of the distribution of weight. And hey, it's not even that uncomfortable either.